Hello, hello, what's up? GQ21, this is DPR Ian. And why don't you come get ready with me for the GQ Man of the Year? Come on, let's go. For me, I think I personally found a lot of beauty in just simplicity. Growing up in Australia, I think environmentally also had a lot of um, influence in the way I dress. So even just like a basic white tee with jeans, I think there's some beauty in that, you know. Basically, when I go on stage, I do want to present myself as the same character that I play conceptually in all the music videos. So what I do pretty much is, um, I first of all go for colour. Obviously, colour is the biggest thing, I reckon, um, in terms of expression. And number two, most importantly, it has to be very um, accessible. I do a lot of big moves on stage, like I do big spins. So if I'm wearing like a jacket that isn't very viable for movement, it's gonna rip. Those two are the main things. Have to be flexible to my movement and has to be very somewhat color adjusted to the character. One of my favorite accessories that I have for now is the Damiani. I was gifted it by my mom. I think this one is my lucky charm and the accessory that I really like. For today's GQ Men of the Year event, I'm wearing the Alexander McQueen 2023 Falls Men's Collection. Every time I wear a jacket, I do like a bit of a pad, you know, enhances a bit of the shoulder. And as you can see, it's pretty revealing, which for me, honestly, it's the first time. I do wish I lost a few more before I did this, but um, it is what it is. Um, I do like that it holds somewhat of the masculinity, but it has a bit of the feminine thing going on here. So it's very genderless. Okay, GQ, this is the final outfit. What do you think? Am I ready? Here we go, to the GQ minute. Let's go.